Hello everybody and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3 where we're going to freaking figure out It'll need to. Where who all is here? Don't hold out the darkness forever. I want to have a word. Hey. That's close enough. Artifact or no, I don't like the likes of you crashing our party. Give it a rest, Alfred. We need all the God's damned help we can get. He's from the Fist and he's from the Harper. I expected a bit more decorum from a flaming fist soldier. Want me to shine your boots while I'm at it? Easy. He's a bit on edge since the, uh, incident. A bit on edge, my ass. Not that you'll give a triple shat damn, but we were ambushed by them bloody cultists. Bastards torched the pigsty we were staying in and made off with the Grand Duke of Baldur's Gate himself. The Absolute's taken him then. No question about it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Saving dudes is one of my specialties. Uh, I was there in the aftermath. I don't suppose Counselor Floric made it all the way here? Sure did. For all the good that does oh. us. Oh. She's inside. One of the ground floor chambers. Come on. We need to talk to Floric. Guess you need to be a God's damned counselor to get room and board around here. Oh. They're all very, uh... They're, uh, they're not having a good time. There's so many of them. Moving ahead. You're a Harper. Hey, it's not enough. Where's the, oh my gosh, where is he? Where? He's in here, I assume. Oh my gosh, is Damon in here? Oh my gosh, I've missed you. He's so attractive. Karlak, I thought you'd be in the city by now. We were ambushed by cultists. Half of us were captured, the other half ran Of course here. they were. Off the anvil into the forge. We'll find them. Hopefully. Before you run off into the belly of the beast, there's something I need He to loves her! Well, two things. Good news I'm and just, I'm bad just news. I mean, I did see it, and I haven't listened to it yet. I need to find it, actually, on my phone. I'm going to do that right now. But apparently, the Karlag Damon ship is quite popular. And my friend and I both actually really love it. And I say this as someone who wants to romance Karlag. I have a great, long-abiding love for, like, mechanic, like, X... <sighs> Maybe, like, captain of the ship they're working on. Or, like, a cyborg, right? Like, a mechanic in their... Like, a, a cyborg in their mechanic. Or a captain in their mechanic. Like, I don't know what it is. It's a good ship. <laughs> like, and like, in every sense of the word, it's a good ship. So, having, like, a mechanic and, like, an infernal iron heart person. Like, I don't know what... It, I, do, I could not tell you. It's like, maybe, maybe it's the whole idea of, like, fixing... Like, actually fixing someone. Like, you can't actually fix a person. But maybe you can help them, you know, with... Whatever it is that they're, whatever that is that they, that they need help with, and you can fix one thing and maybe help them with another thing. You know what I mean? Like I, maybe it's something like that. I don't know, but apparently the voice actor for Damon really likes the ship and made a um uh a, a playlist. I think it's called Fire and Ashes. Is this the one? Mm, no, that's not what it is. I don't think. Oh, this one. Somebody made it was a playlist for their uh, Dark Urge. Damon, Carlac, and Dark Urge character. Heartforge. Apparently the, the, the fans have dubbed it Heartforge, which is just wonderful. He's not all the guy who voiced him made not playlist not just for his character but for the ship between Damon and Karlak. His playlist is the only one with a description, only one with a description, which reads, For my love, Karlak, I work to this music thinking how I can make our love stronger, which is just so cheesy. Damon's Heart Forge music. I love it. I love it. Anyway, I'm just happy. I one hundred percent would shift this. <laughs> Um, what do you want to hear first, Karlak? The good news, obviously. I only need 
one more piece of infernal iron to craft an insulating chamber that can make it possible for Carlick to touch the <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> oh my god. It's really happening. It's been so long. We've got the iron. Let's do this thing. Listen, listen. Hang on. I think you'll want to hear the bad news yeah. too. Yeah. Yeah, sure. But first, fix me. Please. Uh, yeah, we need to let Damon speak. Come on. Fine. Well, go on then. I don't enjoy saying this, Karlak. But there's no two ways about it. Your engine is going to blow and I can't fix it. I'm not sure anyone can. It's simply too hot to exist here in the material plane. Unless you return to Avernus, for good, this thing is going to blow. Sooner rather than later. But... But still, you, you can give me something that will let me touch again, right? Oh, she's so... Yes, but... That's all I need to know. Do it. Please. <laughs> okay, but we do. I, I think I'm be like, hey, like I get it, but I, I want to be like, hey, did you hear Dan said your engine's going to explode soon? But she obviously doesn't care about that. She wants to stay here. She wants to stay free, and she wants to love freely. She wants to touch freely. She's lonely. I never wanted to live yep. forever. I just want to live good. <laughs> I. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Let's go. Well, all right. This shouldn't take long. Just gonna stand here and hover behind him. How convenient to find him. They are definitely avoiding trying to show us what it would look like. Same as last time. You'll need to install it yourself. This should do the trick. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, can I kiss Carlac now? <laughs> so did it... work? Only one way to find out. Oh my gosh, should I kiss her? <laughs> Stand stock still. I'm okay. Hang on. Boop. Um, we both have wanted this for a while, so I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna go in for it. I'm gonna do it. Yes! <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my. Gosh, you're all right. No burns. Um, Can we go to bed? I now? am. <laughs> oh, okay, jeez. Hold on, Karlak. There's something I need to tell you. That engine of yours. It's contained for the moment, but it's just too hot to exist here. Yeah, with we already talked about this. I know you know that. But the thing is, there's a cure. I wasn't making any headway with the mechanics, none at all. The environment here is just too cold to sustain metals like the ones inside you. You have to return to Avernus. For good. Uh-huh. Or th the minute I set foot back in Avernus, Zarya will force me back into service. I'm not doing her bidding again. I'd rather die. I get that, but don't rule it out. The world just might be better with you in it. Even He totally us. loves her. I won't stop trying to figure out a cure, but at this point, I think we all have to face the inevitable. We'll have to make the inevitable evitable then. <laughs> I don't even think that's a word. Uh, I am I'm good. Uh, hang on. <laughs> I don't even think I gotta check. <gasps> it is a 
word, evitable. I mean, in is like a prefix, so it makes sense that inevitable, like evitable, would be a word. But I have never heard it. Able to be avoided or prevented. Avoidable. Heck, yeah. we're gonna have to make the inevitable evitable then. You read my I mind. know. Thanks, Damon. Really, you've given me more than I could ever repay. It's been my pleasure. Good luck, both <gasps> of you. Look after yourself. He's sad. Right. He's sad. Oh my gosh, he's sad. Oh my gosh, you guys. I want. I don't know if that's intentional or if it's just me reading into it. But I 100% think Damon's in love with her. I don't blame him. And oh my gosh. Oh, is this? Is this? The, oh my gosh. I'm so like. Oh my gosh. <laughs> This is the best day. The best day. Uh, I'm so happy for you, for both of us, if I'm honest. <laughs> Me oh too. my gosh. Whenever you want to turn in, I'd love to take this whole touch thing for a test drive. <laughs> oh my gosh. I know we have important things to do, but we deserve a little sweetness too. Uh... I'm, I'm not, no, I, it's her choice, right? I'm not going to say we have to put her in a furnace. She doesn't want to be there. And if this has to be a doomed love, like mine often are, freaking heck, I cannot escape the doomed love. This is, I mean, I think I can fix this. I think I can. But, like, this is, this is just par for the course for me, picking a doomed love. I am just, like, you guys don't even know, I'm, I've flung myself back on my chair at this point, and I'm just, like, a hand on my forehead and I'm like I am just drawn to the tragic loves the doomed romances I can't help myself anyway let's go to bed <laughs> oh man excuse wait. me everybody we're late uh, yep we're going right now I don't whatever else is happening is uh, is whatever yep we're going to camp I am not putting this off. We, she has been waiting a long time. I have been waiting a long time. This is happening. Close your eyes, kitties. Little children's. Potentially. I think I have to go to bed. But... Are we, like, set apart from everybody else? <laughs> hey. Hey. Uh, how's it feel? Incredible. Like I'm really alive. Like we can finally She's be She's so sweet. I can be close to you now without fear. Without thinking too hard. We can just I yeah. love that. No, I like I don't know, just like I don't know. I love the things she says. Like, she's not necessarily, like, a deep thinker. But she's like, I never said I wanted to live long. I just wanted to live good. And, like, you can see, you can hear it in her voice. It's amazing, like, how much she she means that in all senses of the word. Like, she wants to be a good person. She wants to live a good life. You know? Like, I'm just... <laughs> um, you've earned it after all you've endured. No more than anyone else. Well... Maybe slightly more. But that's the past now. I'm free. More free than I've ever been. I'm surprised there. she didn't just drag me off. Do we we do need to talk about look at me smiling? Oh my gosh. What about Damon said about your engine, how your engine won't survive in the material plane? I don't want to think about Okay. That now. I want to think about now. <laughs> I'm so happy. That's all I need to okay. know. Okay. We can't ignore it, but I've never been more excited. I was hoping. <laughs> All right, uh, it is. Get ready. Get buckle up, kids. It is time. It is. It is. I don't care. This is inefficient, but we are. Ooh, baby. Damn it. Who are you? Are you serious, woman? Playtime's over. Pet. Wait. Are you talking to me or Will? Oh, I love this time of year. The dickheads start popping up wherever Excuse you me, lady. What do you want, Mizora? Drop the attitude and perk up your ears. You've got a new mission. I was about to have a Absolute moment. This cult has gone and grabbed one of Zariel's assets. A devil. And a powerful one at that. They're locked up in the cult's fortress. Moonrise Towers. 
and you're getting him out. This devil is so powerful. How did it manage to get captured? Also, this is being cock blocked to the extreme. I don't. I will never forgive Mizora for this. Um, if this devil is so powerful, they managed to get captured. Well, your playmate's wasting precious time. Let's see about getting her priorities fixed. <clears throat> Clause Z, Section Thirteen. Should promised soul refuse obeyance or neglect duty, the pact holder shall cast the promised into a vernus as a lemur. I'll make it simple. Will fails or refuses, and he turns to a thick blob of stink flesh and sinks to a vernus. Now, be a good boy and play fetch, pup, or you'll spend an eternity sizzling in the hells. Zora's words may be flippant, but they are tinged with desperation. Oh! She cannot afford for Will to fail this mission. This may be your best chance to negotiate <gasps> Will out of it. Listen, pack. I was my brain was somewhere else entirely. Uh, hold on. Wait, let me just let me just let me just slap a quick save on there. A lot's happening right now. It figures right going to sleep in uh, in the this cursed place in Act Two. First sleep in Act Two uh, would have some stuff going down. If this blocks whatever is going to happen with Carlac, though, I will be furious. Uh, we'll rescue your asset on one condition. Oh, and what condition is that? Your mind links with Will. <laughs> drawn in by He's like, please, stop, panic. stop, stop. What are you stop. doing? Stop. <laughs> uh, trust me. I don't know if this is a good idea. I don't, like, trying to talk a devil out is not a, but I'm a former paladin. I'm charismatic. We'll see. Will relaxes and your connection fades. Mizora will rescue this asset if you release Will from his pact. That's not that's not the way this works, because if we don't rescue the asset, Will goes down to hell, but I'll try. Interesting. Now, why should I go letting my favorite pet off his You said that to all the pets, I'm sure. Um, remember all you can about devils and their contracts. Yes, that seems like it's going to be the best one. I'm scared. Okay, 14, not too bad. Whoa, I'm scared. Oh. 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 I did it. You recall an old incantation from no a No way, story no way. Said to void a devil's contract. Abi diabole et nunquam it can't, it can't be that easy. It can't be that easy. Say so, you know a pact-breaking charm and chant a series of pseudo-infernal phrases. We could always let the cult infect the asset. I bet they'd make a loyal thrall. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try. <laughs> Dang it! I knew it was stupid. I've Man, oh, I'm gonna a reload. This display of sheer idiocy. Bravo! <laughs> Fine. I'll play your game. But I amend the pact once the mission's done. Not before. Oh. Clause F, Section 9. Soulbinder shall bestow reward or favor only upon soul bearer's fulfillment of related obligation. Now, to moonrise, pet. And do mind the shadows. They've been especially hungry. Okay, so that worked. Uh, yeah, anyway, we listen, Will, buddy, I know we've got stuff to talk about, and I think that worked. What do I have in here? But, uh... Also, what's he gonna be without his pack? Like, he won't be a warlock anymore? I don't know. Uh, well, I hope I didn't just kill Will. Anyway, Carlac time. God damn it! Why did it have to be Mizora? Why did it have to be Zariel? We're supposed to risk our necks to get one of her assets. What if it's a runaway like me? Or something far worse? Oh, that's a good point. Honestly, well, no, Asterians, everybody's got something to say, it looks like. Uh... 
If we don't help, Nizora will turn Will into a Lima. Could you live with that? Look, Will's happiness is my happiness. I thought so. I'd sooner see myself a Lemia than him. But it's a bad idea to play games with the devil. You never win. Not ever. I think she's concerned for me. Well, let's see what everybody else has to say, I think. Or no, Asterian just has other things to say? I don't I don't know. Maybe just Asterian has something to say? Is he mad at me? <gasps> He's probably mad at me. He's probably gonna leave me. I can't believe I still have my shield and stuff. This dark land must be filled with the broken, the beaten, the desperate. The perfect praying ground for a devil who offers a way out for those who sign on the dotted line. I hope we end up seeing our friend Raphael down here somewhere. Do you? I mean, I'll let him make the contract if he wants to. He's a lot of fun and could be useful if we try to get Why do you want to see him? Help me find him, and you'll find All right. out. When I was taken to his house, I was caught off guard. But now, now I know what to ask for. None of these are good options. Sure, I want to see how this plays out. Your funeral, but why not? Not unless you tell me what you're planning. I feel like he's going to get mad at me if I say that. All in due uh. time, but not now. I'm sure he'll turn up at one point or another. I mean, I feel like it's only makes sense that I would be concerned. He's going to freaking leave me at this rate. Like, of course I want to know. I don't know. I don't know. It is what it is. And with that, we'll go ahead and stop there. So thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to every single one of my patrons, including my acorns. Thank you so much, Fane, for your support. I very much appreciate it. And I want to give an extra special shout out to Reese Galito, my sapling tier patron. Thank you so, so much for your support. It truly means a lot. Thank you so much. And I want to give an extra, extra special shout out to Christopher, my forest tier patron, who has gone above and beyond in his support of me in the channel. And I just cannot thank you enough, honestly. Thank you so much for putting up with me and being so supportive and being very nice. So thank you all again for watching and I hope to see you in the next one.